Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Growing Cheetah here, otherwise known as Chris. If you're new to my channel, stick around, see if you'd like to subscribe. If you do, hit that subscribe button. Thumbs up the video if you like it. And um, yeah, leave a little comment down below. So as promised, I'm here to do the full review of the Model 1's trial kit. This is seriously the cutest kit ever. I did my nails in bed because it's actually that, like, how do you say that? Well, it's that portable, it's that small, but it's also that powerful. It's also that powerful. So uh, ignore the one hand that's gloved because I've got like a huge bruise, so I'm trying to hide that since you all know I was in the hospital because I broke my hip. Uh, these ones I can't hide, so I apologize for that, but I'll try and keep it out of frame. So when you get your package, it comes like this, obviously in a nice box and another package, and then all zipped up like this. And this bag you can reuse, so I really like that. Here I have swatches of the colors. This one here, I would call that uh, like when when you're doing like a French nail, that's that type of pink. It's not completely opaque. It'd be perfect for a French nail. Then you have this pink, which is not coming across as bright as it really is in person. But I would say he's a light bubblegum color. And then you have this. Oh my God, I love this color so much. This is... Um, like a pastel aqua. He's absolutely gorgeous. Love him to death. Definitely need to get myself a full size of that. Then you have a light purpley gray. Then you have a light, I guess, mocha brown. And then you have a purpley uh, gray with mauve in there. Beautiful colors. These are two coats, so they're not extremely opaque, but I don't care. It doesn't matter if the color is beautiful, cures well, then I don't mind putting on two thin layers or three thin layers because really that's what you're supposed to do uh, in order to get, you know, the perfect nail that doesn't chip. So... That's of the beautiful colors. So, so pretty. And this is the design that I did with them. Little cherry blossoms. Or, you know, not necessarily cherry blossoms, but just flowers in general. So, so cute. That and that color. That color, oh my gosh, that color is awesome. Okay, so inside your little package, you have your little lamp, okay? I'm gonna open them up, comes packaged like that. Let me all that out of the way, because I wanna get this going, so the video isn't too, too long, but long enough, so you know what's going on. It comes with the manual, which there's like every language known to man in here, um, but there is English in there somewhere. Um, he's a six watt lamp and it doesn't matter if you have a, you know, 24 watt lamp, 36 watt lamp, 48 watt lamp, six watt lamp. It's, it, everything's going to cure eventually. So yes, if you want to, you know, flash cure things a lot faster, well, you'll have a 48 watt lamp, but this little dude, I mean, look at him. Is he not cute? This one's a pink color. And you turn them over and there's the six LED lights. But so you can use them like this and flash cure if you're doing a design on um, your client's nail instead of her having to put her hand in a big light. You just, there you go, and it's gonna keep it in place. Or he's got these cute little feetsies. And he just sits just like that. 
and you can fit your four fingers in there and you just do your thumb separately or you know you push further in to get your thumb after it doesn't matter if I use a big lamp small lamp um, it could be as big as a house I always do the thumb last anyhow because product always tends to shift on the thumb so I'll always go in like that and then the thumb last but to each their own this is where you plug them in that's the on button and now he comes with a USB cord so what's really awesome is my lamp that I have over here that you can't see but I'm gonna plug him in he has a USB port so the other day when I was doing my nails in bed because like I said I hurt myself I mean this is awesome and for anybody who wants to just you know pamper themselves have a little downtime you just sneak off into your room close the door and boom do your nails <laughs> he's that portable that cute that effective and no I'm not saying this because it got sent for review you all know I'm very honest brutal I will tell you eh, I don't quite like this or yes I do like that it has a really long cord so like I said you can plug them into the wall um, with your you know little uh, phone square charger or plug them into your laptop like I did so he has like a lot of cord because my lamps like all the way over there and look how much cord I have so you turn them on and I believe he stays on for 30 seconds and then we'll automatically turn off if you're using darker colors darker colors always take longer regardless of the water of your lamp or how big your lamp is so I'll always do a black or any uh, dark color for a minute or a minute and a half depending what company so I see we'll wait and we'll see you can see he'll go off there in a minute and I'm gonna take out the gels which were very well packaged as well double packaged maybe he goes on for a minute because that's a lot longer than 30 seconds okay move him there just for now he comes with a top coat which is equal to my favorite e-nail couture shiny top coat never thought I'd say that in a million years the quality is the same it does not chip stays there until you file it off and soak it off and it's a 10 mil bottle um, UV LED and it's a no wipe and I also have like a bunch of other colors and over here I have their mat which their mat is awesome but that doesn't come in this kit so you get your top you get your a base coat which does not peel either so fantastic base coat and then I'm just gonna pour these out so you don't hear the bag okay now remember this is a trial kit so you get trial size bottles okay but you get a lot of product in these tiny little bottles and if you're thinking well those bottles are really bloody small this company is um, organic and stuff and all about uh, trying to save the environment so instead of getting say for example a big ass bottle that you know okay it's 10 mil but he's only filled up to there so that's a lot of you know um, product that ends up going into the waste for absolutely no reason so these are lightweight and super tiny okay but yet there is a full 7 ml in every single bottle guaranteed there's 7 ml so you're gonna get quite a few uh, you know manicures out of this it also comes with little stickers let me get all the papers sorry sorry for the noises ow 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 oh my hip okay sorry <laughs> mm -hmm. um I really like that he comes with a little safety paper and he's telling you that he's FDA approved all that stuff environmentally approved other things and you know where other companies don't really say hey you know you may have an allergic reaction um 
but, and it tells you it's harmful to aquatic organisms. You know, so that's nice to know. So don't go, you know, flushing it down the toilet or, you know, throwing it in the lake. I don't know. Maybe you do that. I don't judge. No, I am going to judge if you do that because that's not nice. Don't do that. Um, it'll cause long-term uh, adverse effects in the aquatic environment. So like I said, they're all about trying to save the environment. Um, obviously, do not apply to your nails that are damaged or infected. Keep it a reach of children. Go to the doctor if you get some in the eye or the mouth, which is obvious. And you do like a test if you know that you're already sensitive to gels. However, they're fantastic. Nothing wrong with them. If you can use other gels, use this no problem at all. Comes with these little stickers. You put a little dot. I'm trying to think of the word in English. I don't know why. Uh, in French, enchantillon. Uh, uh, sample. Okay. You put your... <laughs> Sorry, you put your sample dot so you know what's in the little bottle. Because like I said, they're trying to save the environment. So you got these little dots. And that's what I did. As you can see right here. I put all my little sample dots. Cured them in a the little light. Put a little top coat on them. And poof, slapped on top of the bottle. Okay. And it explains right here. Teeny tiny tester size. Uh, size like a like a thimble super tiny sample bottles definitely the sample sizes okay so <clears throat> they're showing you here like the different sizes of bottles like a 15 ml bottle 12 ml bottle 10 7 5 3 and then what the 7 ml bottle looks like so instead of it coming the 7 ml bottle coming in like like i said you know like a bigger clunkier bottle let me see, what's this one? This one's 15 ml, so that kind of blows that out of the thing. But anyhow, this is great. These bottles are super small. Will it be finished within two time usages? No. These gels are durable. All the gel polishes are enough capacity as we promised. You could have a test if you wanted. Well, I could. Okay, so here, this is what I was talking about. So see, there's your typical 7 ml bottle. There's all the wasted product for absolutely no reason where they cut out the waste and there you go. So large bottle doesn't mean better. So, you know, as they say, bigger isn't always better. So these are all the items that you get in the package, which you'll see soon, which I'm going to try and fly through because I've already been videoing for 13 minutes and I don't want anybody getting bored. <laughs> Um, dare to show, be the models one. Like I said, regular usage, blah, 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 blah all that stuff. Um, if you would like to contact them for any questions, their customer service is phenomenal. If you have any questions, they will answer them. And they're fast about it too. So let me, this is oh, my favorite color. So I'm going to open up the little tester bottle. So like I said, he has a shorter brush. That's the only downfall is the shorter brush. It was, I found it difficult to apply onto the nail, but I am going to go get the full size of some of these colors. So, you know, it's going to be a bit bigger because it's not, um, you know, the tester. So he's not going to have such a short wand on him. But I mean, apart from that, I mean, you can see all the way in there. Let me see if I can... I mean, there's product all the way in there and it's got a huge opening. So you're not, you'll also be able to literally get out every single drop. Let's close that back up. Go over here. It also comes with this package right here, which I have not opened. I've been waiting to show you guys. So you get your little duster brush, you know, brush off your, all your dust. You also get little tweezers so you can pick up like, uh, you know, your little gems. You get a buffing block. So this is a shiner and this is a buffer. You get a 100-180 washable and disinfectable uh, file, which I really like. Ooh, I like that a lot. I love the way these feel. Okay, let's just pour it out and get some more. Come on. Give me everything. <laughs> give it to me, give it to me, give it to me. That and you can reuse the this pouch as well. 
So, I mean, saving the environment once again. I plan on saving that, using that for my giveaways. So now you get, you know, your little things that you used to do a pedicure. Um, I use this to open up um, the gel pots, you know, to take the things off, but it's to take your cuticles off. You know, you can use it, not use it, it's whatever you like. You could also use this for um, the poly gel. Okay, you get a bunch of these gel wipes, which I love. And you can soak off your nails with it too. Oh my good God, look at that. Look how many. Look how many. That is a lot. And I go through these on the regular. I buy them in like a big case of 300, I believe it is. Um, you get some tip guides. You get a cuticle pusher and scraper. You get a pair of clippers. Okay. And you get a cuticle oil. Let's open them up, see what he looks like. He's probably one of those twist up pens. Yes, he is. So there you go. You get your cuticle oil. Which, it's very important, do not forget, always apply cuticle oil. After any service to rehydrate your phalanges. Okay, uh, the cuticle pusher fell out of this, so that's what he's in. Okay, so now, on to this cute little devil. Alright, so let me see, I'm going to take a darker color. So this one is 8036. And I'm just going to put uh, the color on. I'm not going to do the base coat. I will do a top coat. But this is just to show. If I can manage to stay in frame for you guys. I'm a little shaky. I still hurt quite a bit, so. Make sure to always move your gel out of the way, even though you may think, oh, but it's just a six watt lamp. Yeah. I had put down a bunch of dots of colors when I was doing my design, and he was over here. He wasn't even close to that, and yet it ended up curing it all. <laughs> I had to scrape it off. Okay, so now you click your little button. You make sure that he's under the little lights, and off he'll cure. So let me see here. While that's curing, I've got my little stand here. Um, shall we try to replicate this? I guess we could. Maybe we can switch up the colors though. Let's switch it up. Let's use this pink. You get out of the way. I am gonna put a base coat on him. I'm not even in frame. Sorry about that. Okay, put on the base coat. Make sure it's nice and smooth. As always with any base coat, you don't have to put on too, too much. But, you know, put on enough. Now let's check our little dude. Ready? Are you ready? Cured. Look at that. So I'm going to top coat him and put him back in for a second. Which, like I said, I love this top coat. Love it. And it doesn't run all over the place either, so it's really good for securing gems. And it's no wipe, so you don't have to worry about trying to go in and get rid of all the tacky layer. Stick him back underneath, turn the light on. I ended up getting a hair on that, but anyways, okay. I'm going to stick him under there. There we go. So he'll cure at the same time. Um, I'm going to need... Okay, hold on. I'm try trying to think of what colors I need to do the flower. Okay, a little bit of him, which would be this one. And then this one in the 8051, which is the lighter brown. A little bit of that, that'll be for our twigs. I'll mix them together. Uh, 
how else did I have my little duty? Oh, yes, I used. Where did he go? That was the chunky one. Mm, where did he go? <laughs> I just used it before I came on here, and now I can't find the color I'm looking for from them. Where'd it go? Where'd it go? Where'd it go? Come on now, where'd it go? Okay, well, I'm going to use not that one. Good lord. I've got all my stuff so mixed up. I'm trying to find a specific one that's going to drive me bananas till I find it. Oh, this one. Shifts colors, the chameleon. That's really pretty, which is 3411. Put a little bit of that on my tile. Hope you guys are still around. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I tried to fly by this, you know, fast, but okie dokie. Okay, now I'm going to use that as the base coat. So then the flower color will use the pretty aqua. Then on my palette over here. Close everything up. Okay, so I have everything on my palette. But like I said, I'm putting it over here because this little bugger cures really good. So if I can just get him out of the lamp. There you go. See how shiny that is? You can see the reflection from my lamp. Oh, it's so smooth, so nice. Love it. Okay, so you've seen that. We cured our base. So now I'm going to do... This bright pink. Well, it's like a pastel bubble gum. That's what I would call it. Okay, well, you guys don't need to see this. You're probably going to be like, okay, well, we've seen things be applied. So I'm going to do two coats of that, and then I'll be right back. And back. Okay. So there he is. Isn't he beautiful? Okay. So you're going to stick on this one? Oh, no. Darn it. Okay, they got the magnets upside down on that one. Okay, so I have to go back to using... This one here, which is fine. Let's see if I can zoom. I was going to zoom in, but <laughs> with the new with the new um, Samsung Galaxy S9, I don't want to take a chance because uh, I'm still not quite used to it, and uh, I don't know what the heck is going to happen. So over here, I've got my little design, which any beginner can do. Which this kit is especially really good for beginners. Because you've got everything you need to go. You don't need anything else. What you have here, you can just run out of the gates with. Okay, so I'm going to start with the darker of the brown on that side. And then I'll start with that. And then eventually maybe I'll mix them together. We'll see. It's all super, super easy. Load up your brush. Just remember when you go to Flash Cure... Or anything like that move your palettes move your brushes because you do not want to cure a yield brushes so i've never done this up in the air before so um if it turns out terrible you'll have to forgive me so there you go light pressure and you know branches branch off I said just slight pressure to make it look real and flowy and organic and come over here do another branch and another one going this way okay move everything out of the way <laughs> like I said move everything out of the way and then we are going to 
to our hand a little bit. Still can't believe how versatile this little lamp is. Seriously. Um, like I said, I'm a broken record, but I broke my hip and I was bored. I was literally going stir crazy, not being able to leave the house to do anything. So I got my son to grab the package, bring it in my room, which I was going to record, but I couldn't figure out how to clamp uh, my phone to record onto, uh, you know, one of those little tables that you put on your bed when you're having like breakfast in bed or something romantic like that. Um... So my clamp wasn't wide enough to open to go around that table because the table, the sides, is like that thick. So that was my initial intentions. But unfortunately, yeah, uh, that did not work out. So hold on a second. I got something cured. Look at that. See, I got something cured on my finger. So now wipe your brush off. And then we're just going to... Go in with the lighter brown. I'm just going to go over and give it a little, a little dimension. Actually, I'm going to use my smaller brush because that one's just ticking me off. So you just go over your smaller brush. Just to give it some highlights and dimension. Okay, and then we're gonna stick it in there again, cure it again, move everything out of the way. I'm gonna clean off my brushes and stick around uh, by the way, because the next video is gonna be about um, giving away some 10 Alpha brush liner brushes doesn't say alpha brush on them because obviously it's too small to stamp, to stamp on it but you'll see it's from alpha brush and then the next one uh giveaway that i do they'll be sponsoring it so i won't be sending it out they'll be sending it out to you is that not exciting totally exciting now back to this package it's 35.99 and i think that's very very reasonable Especially you get all the gels, the top coat, the base coat, all the products that I showed you. Um, if you were buying that one by one by one by one, it would cost a whole heck of a lot more than that. Okay, so now for the flowers, you can use um, a dotting tool. So let's go in. We can use a dotting tool if you want. You do four little dots. Like I said, you just want it to look organic, but you know, it ends up going into a blob anyway. So I just use my little brush and I literally just like floof them out. Is that even a word? Floof them out? Probably not. But that's okay. I'm Canadian. I can do what I want. <laughs> so you just make these like little. not perfectly shaped anything because flowers are not perfectly shaped they are perfect in their own way and that's what is so fabulous about them so you just blot it on grab some more do another one over here a little bit bigger and we can do just some right here as if he's flying away in the wind. So cute, so cute. We'll do one here. Seriously, this color though is everything. Okay, so you just want them to look organic like that. Okay, for this purpose, I'm not going to go too much perfect doing a bunch of them it's just to give you an idea of what to do and art is what you make it so you know you do whatever you want if you think it looks like a flower then it's a flower if you draw a cat well 
as long as you think it looks like a cat, it's a cat. You don't let anybody knock down your art. Okay, so I'm just going to let him long enough. Because I'm just going to go in now. So that was like a flash cure. Now I'm going to go in with that beautiful like chameleon gel. Well, not chameleon, but this shiny one. Which is like purples and pinks and golds. Right here, and number 1118. Also, something you need in your repertoire. Actually, I think before I put that on, I did uh, mix some of these two colors together the two browns to put in the middle of the flower to make it pop. So, we'll do that real quick. It's literally as fast as that. Okay, you wouldn't want to do these on all your fingers. You're doing it for an accent nail. Like I said, take this in bed or even take it in the bathroom with you when you're, <laughs> you know, if you're trying to run away from your kids. We can't always get downtime. We can't always get downtime. So, you know, we do what we have to do in order to have a little bit of sanity in our lives. All right, that's enough. I just stuck my glove in that. Okay, good thing it was my glove. Now I'm going to take some of this. I'm going to ball it on the end, and I'm just going to dot it in the middle of each of my pretty little organic flowers. If you want, you can, you know, dot some all over or like highlight somewhere else with it if you would like. Like I said, I'm keeping this easy, simple, just to show you. And then we're going to top it off and um, that's it. So if you're interested in this product, it's going to be listed down below. Thank you, Models One, for, um, for sending me this for review. I absolutely love it. It's so convenient. It's, uh, I'm pretty sure he's going to spend his time in my room with me um, until I'm finished being healed. Uh, yeah, so this would be perfect in your life, especially if, if you're new at doing this. Like I said, he comes with every single thing that you need and then some. So you got your wipes. You've got, you know, if, like I said about the French manicure with that uh, light pink which was over here, which is number 8053. You could do that. Be perfect. You get the little brush, the snippers, the cuticle pushers. You get the files, another file, tweezers, your oil, and your remover. And of course, your six and beautiful gels. Your base coat and your top coat. Now we're going to top coat him. And that's that. Like I said, link will be down below. You can go check them out on their Amazon store. It's $35.99. Totally worth it, in my opinion. If you like this video, you like this review, and you'd like to see more and like little short tutorials or perhaps just um, a regular long tutorial, let me know because I don't do very many tutorials on here, but if somebody would like to, if, you know, if you guys want to see some, I'd be more than happy to do that, not just reviews. Um, so, you know, hit the subscribe button if you're not already subscribed. Um, give me some love if you don't mind. Hit that thumbs up or, you know, uh, as always, it's your right to hit thumbs down. Either way, it's an algorithm, so I'm down with that. And, uh, yeah, leave a comment. Click that little bell, too, so you can get notified when I do upload, <laughs> which I'm trying to do more often. And um, once again, thank you all for your support and keep supporting each other. And remember, we build each other up. We do not tear each other down. And one person's art, you know, it's everybody's different. What everybody likes. Um, some person will see a cat. Another person will see an owl or maybe just a, a log with some fur. But you know what? It's your cat. If you're proud of it, that's all that matters. So that's, you know, like I said, it's sparse. I did it fast just so you can see and look how shiny 
of that top coat is. Okay, so I love you all very, very much, and I'll see you guys very, very soon. And don't forget shenanigans, because life is too short. Bye.